5 Affordable Beach Towns in Mexico for Investment and Retirement Number 1. Loreto, Mexico Located 741 miles from San Diego in Baja, California Sur, on the west coast of Mexico. The small city had a population of 20,385 in 2019. Loreto is a popular tourist destination, and the cost of real estate and rentals reflects the proximity to the United States. To find affordable rentals, you would need to rent for the long term and provide a consistent income for the property owner. Number 2. Mazatlan. Mazatlan is located on the Pacific coast, across from the southernmost tip of the Baja California Peninsula. The locals earn less than $750 a month, which enables a lower cost of living when you shop where the locals shop. Mazatlan is fast becoming a hot spot for retirees because of great warm year-round weather, with little chance of hurricanes. Mazatlan is growing. There are lots of new developments and the prices for housing in areas where expats, both Americans and Canadians, live are increasing. However at the start of 2023 you can still find wonderful rentals 2-3 to three blocks from the beach for less than $700 a month. You will actually need to go there to find these deals. Number 3. Playa del Carmen. In 2020 the population of Playa del Carmen was 304,942. The locals earn approximately $638 a month after taxes. This means the cost of living is extremely affordable. The weather is great all year round until a hurricane heads toward the area. Playa del Carmen is known for its restaurants and nightlife. Located only 44 miles from Cancun and 34 miles from the Cancun International Airport, the mid-sized town is easy to access. Playa del Carmen is a popular alternative to Cancun and has a lower rental rate and cost for housing. Number 4. Porta Escondido. Porta Escondido is situated on the Pacific coast of Mexico in the state of Oaxaca. You can take direct flights out of Mexico City to Porta Escondido. There is a large community of American, Canadian and European expats in the area. The publisher of this channel spent five months in Zicatila, the small town next to Porta Escondido, and has rave reviews about the surfing she saw and the low cost for food in the area. The last count of the population was in 2010, there were approximately 26,000 residents. The area has grown since 2010 and is recognized as a worldwide surfing destination with a world-famous annual surfing contest. You really can find housing for $300, $400 a month. However, if you want to overlook the Pacific Ocean, you are looking at between $1,200 and up. The locals earn around $400 a month after taxes. The Porta Escondido area is one of the cheapest beachfront towns in Mexico, yet it has a world-class standing as a hot spot for surfing. Number 5. Sayulita. This unique town makes the list, not because of how inexpensive it is, but because of its unique vibe and rental choices. The small town sits right on the coast of the Pacific Ocean and is a popular day trip destination for people visiting Puerto Vallarta. If you select a rental or real estate in town but not exactly close to the beach, you can find affordable units. Generally speaking, especially when you check sites like Airbnb, a little pricey. Rents and the cost of real estate all depends on what you see when you look out from your balcony. If you see the Pacific Ocean, it is expensive. However, it can be very inexpensive if your view includes the jungle. Usually, the jungle view will include a short walk to town. The channel believes Sayulita is the best place to buy a lot and build a home that can view the sea from the rooftop. Realizing that preparing for retirement can be a challenge. If you want to earn up to 14% interest on your investment, check out Ground Floor. This a newer, SEC-registered platform where investors can invest in short-term real estate loans, where the property is held as collateral. Check it out. There is a monetary gift link in the description.